by top headlines that heat will be causing more problems tomorrow. We have heat warnings that will go into effect for northern Utah already in effect for southern Utah and will also have red flag warnings, fire warnings Friday to Saturday for southern and central Utah and that air quality will again be poor tomorrow. Unhealthy for sensitive groups here for Salt Lake County. So tomorrow, 7.30 p.m., we're watching some elevated fire concerns, especially for the West Desert and Southern Utah. A lot of heat in the forecast, even overnight. We're not seeing much relief with our cooling at night, which is a problem. Our houses have a really tough time keeping up. It becomes very hot even overnight. So when you wake up tomorrow morning, 7 a.m., it's still going to be about 70 degrees here along the Wasatch Front. St. George close to 80 degrees at that time. And then tomorrow afternoon, it'll be about 85 to 95, but the heat is going to stick around for quite a while. Towards the middle to end of next week, it'll be a little bit cooler. Potentially the wind kicks up, but no major changes happening in the next couple of days. So for a future cast tomorrow, tracking that chance for showers and thunderstorms to develop about 3, 4 p.m. tomorrow here across the region. Come Saturday, same thing. We'll have the possibility of some showers and thunderstorms here across the region. And then we'll see just hot and dry conditions into next week. So for St. George, we keep you close to 105 for Friday and Saturday, 101 for Sunday, and then mid to upper 90s next week. So no big cool downs. So we have to really be careful, drink plenty of water, be careful tomorrow in the sun. Just regardless, in addition to the temperatures, it's a UV day. Our index for tomorrow is extreme. So so harmful UV rays, especially from 11 to 4 p.m. So just make sure you're drinking plenty of water, checking on the elderly, children, kids uh, that are newborn. Uh, that's a high risk category and actually high risk for a lot of the population come tomorrow for those heat related illnesses. We're keeping it close to 90. This is all above average throughout the entire seven day forecast, 90 to 95 for the most part. But tomorrow will likely be our hottest day. And if we hit 100 degrees tomorrow here in Salt Lake City, that that would be the earliest on record that we've ever had a triple digit day here in Salt Lake City.